19% left. And here we are at Allego Ermont. Yes, to the left. Keep right. We can also do uh, some COVID testing. Oh, there's a new hypercharger. That's what makes me happy. The, we know what we're going to connect to. A Lego branded hypercharger. Welcome to Thermal. Close to Maastricht. We could make it to Maastricht, but then we would arrive with practically nothing. Uh, arrive in a city with one 50 kilowatt charger. Maastricht is not really the capital of fast charging yet. So, and then at McDonald's maybe there's a queue for 50 kilowatt fast charging, who knows. So we thought let's try Allego and Allego has upgraded this location because there used to be two Effacheck chargers and now there is one hypercharger. So let's see what happens. Wow, this first battery reading, we're at 19% and it, what is this? What is going on with these Chinese EVs that they give this information so weirdly? Ah, 20%, there we go. Oh, nice data. And it's even doing a prediction till 100%, which obviously is very hard to believe. I really like the fact that we have amps and volts because what Fastnet did is they changed the software and it doesn't display amps and volts anymore because people were complaining about it. Well, that is a very weird reasoning. Can you can you put the charge card again so we have the big layout thank you so interesting that it I wonder if that time till full would ever be true I absolutely don't believe it I think so 44. So amp seems to stabilize at 144 and with the volts raising a little bit could get even more charging speed than this still. <laughs> Let's cook the battery. minutes nearly 17 kilowatt hours stable small drop after 30 minutes of charging so the car says that it will be full in 18 or 17 minutes charger says 19 I don't believe any one of those as you can see the amps are dropping but the volts are going up 